Day three, I have eight hours to finish this painting. I don't know how I feel about that, but I'm just gonna get started and see how far I can get. But I think right now it's kind of difficult to balance. Like Seven wants to get all these stupid, cool shots. And I really wanna focus on the painting, but we both have like these projects that we're working on. So to balance those two things, it's like really gonna come to a head today. going pretty good I have I think five and a half hours left um, I originally had something planned for this afternoon so I was gonna try to plan around that but that got canceled because of the snow so I have like more time than I was planning on which is good because I think I'm gonna need that time right now I'm gonna go in with like a lot more white with some of the blue and then I have to wait for both those things to dry. And then from there on out, it's kind of like the home run. I'm just like doing a bunch of details, um, which is work that I get a lot more excited about. Cause like painting these like giant chunks of one color is not that exciting for me, but it's like necessary to get it done. All right, now I'm gonna start painting the white. <laughs> All right, it is 1.30 p.m. Um, which means you have two and a half hours to complete this. <laughs> yeah. I feel actually pretty good about it. There's still like a lot more that I wanna do. I was feeling like really insecure like maybe like 30 minutes ago and then I painted a little more and now I feel a little bit better about it. So I'm just trying to like kinda take it all in and like figure out what it needs. I wish I had more time though. Like I wish I had another day. That way I could like sleep on it and then I could wake up and be like, oh, I should have done this. All right, I'll see you guys at the finish line in two and a half hours. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> later it is 3:33, which means you have 27 minutes left which means you completed the challenge and I think it looks really awesome so how is this different from the other murals you painted uh it was a lot easier in some ways and a lot harder in some ways it's really weird because like it made time pass very quickly like I, d I can't really believe that I started this three days ago it feels like I just started it quote unquote done although there may be some things that like a week later I'll be like shoot like I need to fix that or do you um, feel that way with the other murals where you're like oh uh I do but usually with the other murals since like more time passes I get so sick of it that like at, s at a certain point I'm just like okay this is how it's gonna be and yeah. I just have to accept it um, but with this, because I only spent three days, I'm still kind of like reeling from like the, even like the idea in the first place and then just like starting it. It's kind of hard to believe that like I did this, but yeah, it's really cool. I helped a little bit yesterday only. <laughs> oh. You should, oh, you should show the. I'll just show the details of it really quick. So there's a little Easter egg over here, as you guys saw, is Eden's signature, Eden Crawford, and the date, 2022. I'm not quite sure yet how to like go about like advertising myself for this type of thing, but I am really interested in doing murals. Um, so if you have like a specific idea and you're like, oh, and if you see my art and you're like, oh, that's, I can totally see 
my idea and are you talking to me or are you talking to them them so eden is looking for more work uh and this is what her work looks like yeah but i awesome. only i only want to do a mural for someone if they like like my art style because yeah. I, and and i have to have this like certain level of freedom with it or else i won't feel like i'm the person for you like you might need to find someone else so if you live in kentucky or ohio anywhere near really then uh go check out link in the description i guess i'll put your instagram down there and they can con message you through that way and then i guess would you make like also like art online that people oh yeah yeah all the time so she can also you can message her about um custom art like pieces of paper and she can ship it to you i guess pieces of paper i also do like recycled wood frames and everything yeah windows you did windows let me know what you guys think in the comments i suppose and uh yeah we'll see you guys uh next time but well before you go actually one announcement i made my own youtube channel the link will be in the uh, description below uh where i'll be posting my personal own videos of just whatever so go ahead and check that out thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time <laughs> All right, first look, mom and dad's first look of the mural. Come on in. Okay. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Okay, go. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my God. This is so cool. Damn. The Squally's oh, first look of it too. The Squally, look. Whoa, There's I gotta get like perspective here. Oh, it's right in your face. Yeah. Don't step on any of my expensive, valuable stuff. Yeah. That'll look. Do you know who that is? Right there. Someday. <laughs> Someday, maybe that's gonna be us. Someday you'll get to the bottom. Right? <laughs> yeah. No, that'll be us after we summit it, hopefully. After you summit it. Yeah. Where's the Nesquale Glacier? I think it's right the Squally there. Glacier. It's either there or there. So that's the Columbia Crest, and that's Point Success, and that's the Liberty Ridge, all on the right-hand side. Yes. And that's, uh, that's Little Tahoma on the right. Wow, this is cool. How come the other murals aren't this cool? Because they're not all on that right here. <laughs> Jeez, what do I, I should have only given you three days on all those. Mm, that's pretty neat. You guess I'm out of this? Let me guess. <laughs>